if you go outside or have somebody go outside for a long time and they come back in they smell like outside and I hate smelling like outside <laughs> Welcome back to my channel. My name is Kayla. If you're new, I film beauty, lifestyle, and travel related videos. So if that's something you're into, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Also hit those post notification bell so you'll always know when I upload a new video. Make sure you follow me on Instagram at just Kayla Michelle and give me a like on Facebook by the same name. So guys, I am looking the same as I have for the past three videos because I'm actually pre-recording three videos in the same day. So yay me. <laughs> So in today's video, I'm actually going to be showing you the best fragrance mist that you can wear for a beach or a pool day. So these are just, you know, some cool little scents that you can just chill out by the pool or by the ocean or whatever, or just a nice little summer day on the porch. So without further ado, let's go ahead and hop into the video. I do actually have two fragrances to show you guys from Dossier and they were nice enough to send me some more fragrances to show you guys. So if you're not familiar with Dossier, they're literally a fragrance house that makes dupes for your favorite high-end fragrances. So the best part about these actual fragrances is that they literally smell just like the ones that you would pay a whole lot of money for. These only cost between $29 and $39, and they do make fragrances for men and women. Some fragrances are even unisex, so everybody can get what they want. So with Dossier, they actually send you a card that shows the information about the fragrance that you are purchasing they actually also give you a little sample of the fragrance as well as the big bottle of the perfume they have a risk-free system so if you actually try this little sample size out and you decide that you don't like it you can send this unopened bottle back with no questions asked for a full refund or you can another fragrance that you have been dying to try out one thing i really like about about dossier because who do you know that sends you a little sample of a fragrance and you can still send the other one back and get your money back like this is enough in here that you can see if it meshes with your body chemistry if you really like it or and you can really see if you really like it or not so I feel like a risk-free satisfaction guaranteed policy is amazing so the first fragrance that I have to show you this is actually floral grapefruit and this is inspired by chance by Chanel so the top notes are grapefruit pear black currant Middle notes are hyacinth, jasmine, and lilac. The base notes are orris, musk, and amberwood. You guys know I love anything with amber. I love anything with musk. I'm not even gonna mess with the little uh, sample because I already know that I love this because I actually have the Chance by Chanel bottle to actually give you guys a comparison. I'm really happy that I had this because I'm almost out of the Chance by Chanel. So this is great that I can still have a backup. And you guys know how we are about backups on this channel. We love to back up our favorite fragrances. So if you look at it, of course it has that magnetic top. It posts the notes on the fragrance. So you can always know what you're picking up and it's nice and sleek. So let's go ahead and spray this one on this arm. Okay. Y'all, I love this so much. And then let's spray this one. My little sprayer is... Okay. So smelling both of these legit, I don't really smell a difference. I really don't. And this one actually, the one from Dossier actually seems a little sweeter to me. But all in all, they smell the same. And, uh, and honestly, once you actually put this perfume on your body and it dries down and start me starts meshing with your body chemistry, you will not know a difference. And whoever around you won't know the difference either. And they won't know that you didn't spend a whole bunch of money on an Eau de Parfum. If you like Chance by Chanel, hi I would highly recommend you try that floral grapefruit because, honey, it's hitting. This is Floriental Coconut and the notes for this, oh, and this is actually inspired by Tom Ford Soleil Blanc. And this is the Eau de Parfum. So the top notes are cardamom, pistachio, and bergamot. Middle notes are ylang ylang, tuberose, and jasmine. And the base notes are cedarwood, amber, menzoin, and coconut. So this has a lot of things I thoroughly enjoy. Going through Dossier has allowed me to try a lot of Tom Ford 
um, perfumes because other than that, I can't spend all that money on perfumes. Like I really can't, it's, re it's hard for me to buckle down and actually give over $100 for a perfume. Okay, so a lot of people rave about this perfume. And this is very sexy. I really smell like the woodsiness of this perfume. I can't say if it smells exactly like it because honestly, I have never had Soleil Blanc by Tom Ford. But just going into this as a regular perfume, I would definitely wear this. This is like a sexy night out. This is like a professional smelling perfume. And then of course you can pair this with um, other fragrances. I would actually pair this with my aromatherapy cedarwood and vanilla just because this literally has that cedarwood in there and that would help to sweeten it up a little. But I'm really interested to see what the dry down would be because right now I'm really enjoying this. And this is something different for my collection because you guys know I'm always going for fruity or sweet fragrances but this one is very sexy and sophisticated so i cannot wait to wear this i'm going to actually put a code on the screen for you guys and i'm going to link dossier down below as well as my code again in case you missed it so that you can go try out these um perfumes for yourself so thank you so much dossier for collaborating with me yet again on another video so guys let's go ahead and get into the fragrance mists that are perfect for the beach the first fragrance mist that I have to show you here is the Water Mist, and this is from Victoria's Secret Pink. So the notes for this are Salty Driftwood, Solar Amber, and Warm Sand. So this is a very aquatic scent, but it's also warm at the same time, which I thought was really interesting because usually when you have an aquatic scent, there's not a lot of warmth to it, but I really think that the amber helped to warm this scent up. It literally smells like water but still has a perfume feel to it as well. Now I will say the lasting power on this is not great, but I like to wear this literally out the shower. And I feel like if you want like a quick freshen up after the pool and you take a quick little pool shower and you spritz this on you, you still feel like you're wearing something and you don't just smell like chlorine. So this is highly recommended for the beach as, as well. Mostly I think for the pool because you know, if you're on your way home, you just want to spritz something. If y'all stop for ice cream after the pool, you don't want to just smell like pool water, but you still should smell like some type of water because we rinse off after we get out the pool. <laughs> but I think that water mist is perfect for days like that. It's very summertime to me, and as you can see, I have been absolutely loving it. Hopefully you can see how much I've used. See better like this, yes. So this is Bronze Coconut, and this is another Victoria's Secret pink fragrance. So the fragrance notes are toasted coconut and creamy sunbeams. Don't know what creamy sunbeams are, but they're there. And I just got this all over myself. That's fun for me. But yeah, I really enjoy this because it's so tropical. It's so warm. This literally smells like a sunset. If you were on the beach, like if you were spending all day in Miami and you're just trying to wind your day down and watch the sunset on the beach, this is what that smells like. This is definitely an evening type of fragrance or it's just, you know, you can wear it all day and you can literally bake in the sun and smell amazing. So I think bronze coconut is perfect for the beach, perfect for the pool, you know, just for those days that you want to lay out and chill. So the next one is a new one that I have not worn yet, but this is absolutely amazing. So this is Tease Dreamer and this is from Victoria's Secret and this does have notes of coconut in it. So this is nice and tropical, pretty and light. This is the perfect daytime beach or pool fragrance. It just smells so good. Like I really cannot even describe it, but I definitely smell the coconut in there and I smell a little fruit as well. This will go so well on the skin, especially if you're going to a pool party. I feel like this is perfect for a pool party because this does have a little more fragrance and it has a little more projection to it. So people are going to smell you while you're just hanging around in your bathing suit, probably not get in the pool because you're too cute to get in the pool. But <laughs> if it's that type of party, this is definitely perfect for that. Or if you're like walking the streets, you're walking the boardwalk or something like that, you're just having a nice day by the beach, you're not really getting in the water you're just putting your feet in the water. Tease Dreamer is a perfect fragrance for that. 
Next, another pretty um, daytime fragrance I feel is Hibiscus Paradise, and this is from Bath & Body Works. I really enjoy this because it has a nice coconut scent, it has a nice guava scent. So the notes are pink hibiscus, juicy guava, and sun-kissed coconut. I think this is absolutely perfect for the summertime, perfect for your beach day. Because I can picture you wearing a nice, cute, flowy cover-up over your bathing suit, and you just spray this on, and someone gets a nice breeze of your air as you walk by, and they're like, wow, you smell absolutely amazing. So the guava in this really helps to lighten this up, because other than that, it would just be a hibiscus coconut scent, but the guava does add something different to this. It makes it smell a little more juicy, so I really enjoy Hibiscus Paradise, and I did actually just get the perfume little travel size spray and that'd be perfect for your beach bag and i got that for 75 percent off from the semi-annual sale which i'm really sad it's over but we're just gonna let it go and move on because it was really fun doing that for so many weeks but hibiscus paradise is a great fragrance especially if you're doing a little bit more than just getting in the water if you're trying to look a little cute and you're just trying to be you know eating at a little beachside restaurant or something like that i think that'd be absolutely perfect for that the next fragrance is literally at the beach and i love this packaging so much it's a such a pretty turquoise blue green color it literally looks like the ocean and why not wear at the beach at the beach so i do have the travel size um shower gel that i took on vacation with me in march when i went to florida so you got you guys will hear me reference in florida a lot because that's my favorite place so that's really like the main beach that I go to is anywhere in Florida. Fragrance notes are white frangipani. Frank is it? Okay. I feel like I heard this. I feel like I looked it up. Frangipani? Frangipani? I don't know, but I know it's not frangipani. It's maybe frangipani. <laughs> Blossom, toasted coconut, bergamot, bergamot water, sea salt breeze, and sun-kissed musk. This is an absolute must for a day at the beach. Like, if you're about to go to your hotel's pool, like rooftop pool, or they have a pool in the back that overlooks the ocean, like it has, it's like an infinity pool or something like that. Any type of resort, I feel like at the beach is perfect for. I can literally picture it now. I can picture sitting in a beach chair, spraying this on, you know, getting my Instagram pics because I'm not swimming in the ocean. <laughs> and just smelling like the beach so this is absolutely amazing and you can always of course as i always say you can layer any of these together and you can come up with the perfect little mix i feel like it's great for after you get out of the pool or after you get out of the ocean and this is sea island shore this is such a fresh clean scent and of course we want to smell fresh and clean after we've been swimming all day or after we've been you know in the ocean or at the lake or anything like that so sea island shore has fragrance notes of clean cotton orange blossom blue freesia and ocean musk so of course with that ocean musk in there it just immediately makes me think about being by the water and i actually love to wear this on days that i'm just feeling fresh and clean but of course when you're going to the pool or when you get out of the pool this is an absolute must because you can just freshen yourself up before you actually go home and take your real shower unless you know you're at your hotel or anything this is perfect for out of the shower this is perfect for before you go and enjoy your aquatics for the day next is saltwater breeze of course i had to bring saltwater breeze up this is the beautiful packaging this is just like the most oceanic scent that i could have ever smelled it literally smells like the ocean i love the smell of the ocean i love the smell of the water the fragrance notes are fresh linen violet leaves water blossom and white musk this is just absolutely amazing i actually wore this um this past week when i went on the reservoir close to our house we did actually go on the boat and i feel like this was the absolute perfect scent to wear but that day since i was a little hung over i actually mixed it with coconut so i can sweeten it up some and this is what coconut looks like this is another scent that you can literally wear um for the beach i didn't include it on my list but i feel like this is another perfect beach or pool scent anytime you're going to be out in the sun anytime you're going to be out in the water i feel like you can't go wrong with the coconut scent speaking of coconut of course i have another one so this is key west coconut water and melon this is your cool chilling you know not too harsh coconut scent 
and I know a lot of people may not like coconut but this one is a little more fresh and cool and clean so this one has coconut water salt water waves and fresh melon so it's a little sweet a little fresh and a little tropical as well when you're cool as a coconut cool as a cucumber this is literally what i think about this is very relaxing very calming very comforting and you can really get away with this with any just chill activity that you're doing if you're at a beach house or something you can just get out the shower spray this on and be cool for the day to chill the nice breeze going past and wafting in the air i just feel like this is just a perfect lounging scent and you can wear this around your house as well just to give you the feel that you're at the beach chilling you know if you're like some of us and you don't have a beach close to you definitely smell Key West uh, coconut because it will put you in the mind of being on island time and just relaxing so the next scent, I definitely think this is a perfect beach scent because it puts me in the mind of being at the beach being at the pool chilling in a cabana or just laid out in the sun under your umbrella just catching some rays or not whichever you prefer but this is sun kiss and this did come out this past season so of course it has that pretty sailboat the sun the birds the beach just everything you would need for your perfect beach day so the fragrance notes are sun drenched orange sun drenched orange blossom sparkling sea salt and vanilla breeze so this is like your sun tanny a little bit of citrus a tad tad bit salty fragrance so this literally smells like sunscreen with a little bit of citrus but not too much i feel like the vanilla breeze helps to calm all that down so it's not like overpowering but you're going to be having your sunscreen on anyway because you should we should all be having our sunscreen on i actually got burnt a little bit yesterday on my chest i don't know if you can really tell but it's kind of red right here but because i didn't put my sunscreen on I was being bad so just remember to put on your sunscreen but yeah this is like the perfect daytime beach scent I feel like because if you're like laid out on your blanket or something and you just want a little quick spritz so you just don't smell like outside outside has a smell I'm telling you if you go outside or have somebody go outside for a long time and they come back in they smell like outside and I hate smelling like outside <laughs> but that's another that's another you know story but definitely um sun kiss and that's still available right now so go ahead and try that out if you want to go ahead and go to the beach and lay out in the sun so the last one i have to show you here this is such an amazing fragrance this is midnight swim she is the epitome of sweet and fresh she is so good so midnight swim and actually midsummer dream both remind me of saltwater breeze they have components of saltwater breeze they're not the exact same but they will put you in the same mindset so i feel like if you have either of those fragrances you're set you're good to go you don't really need them all of course i have them all because i'm excessive but you really don't need them all so this one is blue waters beach flower and fresh coastal air so with this fragrance it i was surprised to get a little bit of sweetness in this so it wasn't just completely just fresh and clean just overpowering like detergent or laundry sheets this one definitely had a little sweetness that helped tone it down i don't know where the sweetness is coming from i don't know if it's from the beach flower but this is such a good fragrance i didn't even really know if i was gonna like it like that but i just think first of all the packaging this whole line was so cute with the little lighthouse and just your nighttime beach walks it definitely makes me think of you know walking on the beach and just enjoying listening to the ocean if you don't know the ocean is like my absolute favorite thing going on cruises is my favorite way to vacation because i just love being on the water so so much i love listening to the ocean so so much i love feeling the ocean breeze smelling the air coming back to the hotel room complaining about all the sand in my sandals that i tracked in and how we need a broom to sweep it up that's like my favorite thing the nighttime at the beach is like one of my favorite times because it is so serene so relaxing and it's also scary at the same time because it helps you to think about how small we are in this world yeah so those are all the fragrances that i have to show you guys um in this uh, thank you once again to dossier for sending me some fragrances don't forget guys to click the link down below in the description so you can shop and then make sure you use my code so you can save even more money off of your purchase i hope you guys enjoyed this video and i will see you in my next one bye guys